Must I remind you we gave our word to the council? That should probably mean something. Pike, this creature is beyond us. When Vax and I were young, one of those monsters killed our mother. I've studied dragons my entire life, hoping to find the one that did it. I can feel when they're close. A horrid pain in my head. Then it's settled. We'll go back to the palace and get out of the contract. You don't understand, Percy. I felt it there too, at the palace. Bad dream? Is there any other kind? I'm simply suggesting you could all benefit from some well-practiced restraints. Emotions aren't meant to be bottled up. Maybe you should cut loose once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> this is fantastic. Diplomats are here from all over Taldori. Fort Daxio, Kaimor, Westron, uh, even... From Whitestone, Lord Silas and Lady Delilah Briarwood. Stone was my home, until those fiends took everything from me. What do you want us to do? Should we say something to Uriel? I can't. Looks like they're staying overnight. Excuse us for a moment. <laughs> Percival, darling, what did we say about emotions? You don't? Understand. Then help us understand. The Briarwoods. They murdered my entire family. Would you look at that, dear? It's the pup who survived. All grown up. Step off, bitch. I was using that. We need to talk. All of us. Come on. Percival? Certainly. What would you like to discuss, Vexalia? <laughs> For a start, what the hell happened back there? You never thought to mention that the Briarwoods killed your family? Morbid. I wasn't aware that you were owed information about my past. When your past comes to kill us, I'd say we deserve a heads up. And how exactly was I to know the Briarwoods would be attended? I want to know about the smoke! Sorry, I did... did loud, sorry. Smoke. My weapon burns black powder. Perhaps that's what you saw. What we saw was you shooting an innocent kid. No one in the employ of the Briarwoods is innocent. The boy knew nothing. He was terrified. Slightly more so after you exploded his hand. <sighs> Maybe I got carried away. But you don't know the Briarwoods. What they did to my family. The Briarwoods know I'm alive now, and they are not in the habit of leaving loose ends. So what's your plan? No goodbye? I'm going to Whitestone. And so are we. If we beat Silas, his charm on Uriel will fade. We're all with you, but... No more secrets, all right? Understood. Thank you. All of you. Please stop that. I'm trying to concentrate. Oh, is that what you're doing? I thought you were practicing your resting bitch face. Excuse me? My bitch face? You're heading home. Figured you'd look happier. This isn't a homecoming. This is a suicide mission to topple the necromantic murderers of my family. And for the record, I have a magnificent bitch face. <laughs> do you now? Yes, I do. Lots of practice. <laughs> Come on, Percy, faster! Yeah! This thing was not built for speed, and did you just hear me? Yes! On the cut! Percy, holding that weapon, it's like you're a different person. What is it?
When we came here, darling, you promised no more lies. You owe us the truth. You're right. Thinking about your sister? Is it that obvious? She was 13 when you last saw her, right? Such a sweet age. She was a nightmare. Always got me in trouble. Terminally irritating, pompous, utterly incapable of silence. <laughs> she sounds like Scanlan. <laughs> They're not entirely different, no. I hope she's okay. Scanlan, too. Darling. Scanlan's probably three deep at a brothel right now. Who let that sex crazed gnome do this solo? Um, you? Oh, never listen to me again. That's it. I'm calling it. You're just going in? The longer we wait, the more we risk being discovered. On my shot, we move. Let's not be rash, Percy. Holy shit. He did it. And it looks like he went all out. Oh, yeah. He's into that freaky stuff. Moving back! Excellent plan, Vox Machina. I mean, that is what we're known for. I'll rally the rebels. When you have her, send a sign. I am Lord Percival Frederick Stein von Musel Kolowski de Rollo III. On the day the Briarwoods took Whitestone, I watched my family die. Despite my desire for vengeance, I fled, and fear kept me from my home. We have all lost. But Archie never feared, never wavered. He willingly gave his life for all of us, for Whitestone. His sacrifice, your sacrifice, and the sacrifice of my family shall not be in vain. Today is for Archie, for the Dorolos, for Whitestone! The Dawn Father has found life in you. Use his gift wisely. Well, fearless leader, lead. There must be a way out of this. Anyone have a plan? Vex? Why are you looking at me? Percy, a little help? Right, well, um, try to stop the acid. Percy, snap the fuck out of it. We came here risking our lives for you. Be here for us. What's the point? She's gone again. Maybe. But the people in this room, we're not. We will never abandon you. You want your sister back, and I want my brother. But if we're to have a chance of saving them, you have to save us first! <sighs> Good to have you back, Percival. Step aside. You're going to shoot me too? If we must. I know you're in there. Darling, take off the mask. <laughs> it's all right. You can put it down. It? I did! Vex? Wait, no! What are you doing to me? <laughs> You're not under a charm anymore, damn it. Do something! Against a demon? What? You're his sister. Reach him! Wait! Please, Percy! Don't forfeit your own soul! She shot me! Yes. Well, thank you for not dying. Yeah, you're welcome. So, that was the most fucked up thing I've ever seen. And I hang out with Scanlan. 